about what we talked about last class, that a base and a log of that base are inverses of each other. A base and a log of that base are in inverses of each other. So um, when we're asked to to the log of 4, I have a base. No, well, no. Um, the log itself, you know, normally you can see right here, there's a base of five. But we learned last class. So now once I've written it there, if we have 10 to long base 10, they cancel each other out. You just put the 10 as like a subscript of log to cancel it? No, it's there, but it's just like, what, what kind of root is this? Well, how did you know? It doesn't have a little 2 here. I mean, it's just kind of common knowledge. Well, that's what this is. Common knowledge. Well, it is what is called the common logarithm. It's All right, so going back to question B, we've got log base 5 of 25 to the x. But can you make it into a base of five? Yeah, by doing yeah. um, five one, two, three, two, twenty-five, or twenty-two, right? Five sort of desire, yeah. Five. Change it into five squared. Okay, but. Chapter five, oh. which some of you still are learning. Um, what do I do with I've got log base 5 of 5. Because you what have the x, but since you put the parentheses, okay. you have to. Thank you. I can erase things fast. I can uh, use all kinds of fun colors. My board is very sensitive to when I get the pen to play. be perfect. It won't be. I've used it for so many years, and that's... So, it's... Yes. So, just... The other side, like that. Value, basically. Not right now. Okay, so. They do. 
first two done. Whoa, that's right there. No, so I got... Into two to the six, and I bring that X down. Oh, it's a nice six, six X. So the answer is six X. We also learned that um, if I have log base of E, so if I see a base of E to LN power with a 20, Is log base e, but you will not see it as log base e. Let's put two e. Yeah, Wait, just one second. Yeah. Log base seven. Uh, yeah. That is not. That's a sentence for you. did in section 5-6, you did a review on Friday, and some of you were coming in and still asking me questions about the review, totally fine, because we haven't graded it yet. Boom. Exponential, yeah. So, does anybody remember, because you just did Y, but I don't have a Y yet. You have so to switch f of x and make it Y. Make it a Y first. I know. And then. Okay, here's another place where. You have so the question is, how do you cancel out Don't square root. These are all things I see people do wrong. So y it, or x equals the, I had to do this the other day. No. So we're going to do long base 6 of x. Oops, I meant to make that color coded. Anything that cancels out a base of 6. 
So it's y equals log. Because that's the inverse. Yes. No. Well, wait, what are you taking? Oh, then no. Oh, question B, first step. Oh, wait, you you back to the other one. side. Was the original question y equals? No, no, no. Are you being serious right now? Yeah. So it has to be f. Switch it back to function notation only because it started in function notation. So I had to switch it back at the end. That was all. Okay, now, the next one is not starting in... Now we need to solve for y. So you guys look at this side. What is the outermost? Y plus three. What is the outermost thing I have to get rid of first so I can start to get it? You have to get rid of the left. The I N. Log e. No. L and E. E is L N. But the inverse is. So the something. What's the something? I have a question. Yeah, it'll be there. When you write it out on the x side. to the ln parenthesis y plus 3. Y plus Bit. Next example we're going to do. It is log base. Oh, we're still oh, back up. Yeah, 
go back up. Oh, sorry. Number 17. This is now number 17. After I have those original notes, um, the questions in your assignment, I needed to give you some more that were like those. So that's what I did. Okay, um, so number 17, we're going to switch X and Y, right? to get rid of first. Uh, one. It's the one. So I'm going to add one. Over. The next thing I'll do after I move it over, let me just write this before I say that. X plus one there. It's messy over in this corner more than it is in that corner. I mean, I do, but not that bad. So now I have y equals two. I can't see the next question because I went too far. Uh, so. The Twice as long to go up here than me, who's been using this since 2000. What's time? We don't know. A different day when we're not. When you look at Y, what is the outermost thing that's being uh, done to the Y? The 5. How do we get rid of the 5? Just goes like next to the stone. What would put things in exponents Whoa. would be a base like E. X over five equals. How do you get there? How did I get what? All of them. Roger, say it. Oh, wait. Okay, no, I'm not confusing. Okay. Good job. Mm -hmm. LN. These mean the same thing, but somebody decided.
too many letters to write. Okay, do you have a question? Now. Is that it? Okay. The last thing we're going to do is we're going to graph. I'm totally making something up right now. I'm making it up right now. All right, so what you have here is you have two different examples. Shaper. Exponential, this is growth. What is the asymptote? That's the asymptote. That is graphed right here. So the blue ones are next line. Since we are graphing by switching x. So if you graph any ordered pair with zero first, it's going to be here. Because the x is not left. X equals zero. Right. So you just switch. 
Do you remember the... In red, okay, is the numbers. domain going to be over in numbers? No. The range. Range for the blue one was y is greater than zero. So the domain for the red one is graph the um, exponential. We've already spent time on. more to it that is not on your page. Also, um, these words are not on your page. These are words. Okay, so when we have graph f of x equals log base 3 of x, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to think about what is the inverse of this log base 3 of x. My, my y values will be zero, one, one, <laughs> three, and three. There is an asymptote. Is that y one, equals zero. zero. I'm graphing at all. My second step is we're all of the x and y's, and that's what we graph. So the log base 3 of x is now let's just switch these. So I'm going to have one third. So that's what we're going to graph. Is this still x and y? Yes. So now at x equals 0, I've got my asymptote. It's fine if you know how to do this already. I see why you're one third on. On the x, negative 1 on the y. I'm going to graph 1x, 0y, plus closer and closer to the asymptote. Mm -hmm. Is that the inverse? Yes, that is, well, that's not the inverse. That's not the blue one. That's, that's the right. actual one. Let's pretend the original question was not log base 3 of x. The original question Because it's yeah, But you're close. 
minus 6 because it's the inverse because you've got to do this. It's not. Only till I've done these do I now go back and say what does plus six do? Translate. I'm gonna go to the red one and subtract six to all of my values in that table. So what's one third? Take away six. I'm doing this one in purple now. Wait, what? Down six or up six? Move left six. It's negative one. I've got negative five zero, and I've got negative three one. Yeah. Because I didn't have any examples that were like that. And Then zero one, one is two, y equals zero. I do not need that for any of the graphing. I need that to do what in my next Plus step? three to the y. I'm not there yet. <laughs> That's the one I didn't know. You're right, you are. So much better, but not as accurate. Wait, do we have to have it green? Yes, but this is not. As good as I can. What's the 
the last step? Add three. And we're going to add three, but is that going to translate right or is it going to translate up? Which, uh, where am I adding three? Uh, uh, That doesn't All right, number 20. You will, wait, wait, 20, I kind of did one like that. I want to see. reminder like I'm going to plug in negative one, zero, one. My inverse is just to make my new table. Yes, that's what I meant. So now I'm going to switch all my x's and my y's. I will have. Okay. So I'm going to graph that because we are graphing like. No, no. Half. <laughs> My finger will. Do you want us to do both graphs or just that? Awesome. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Now, in your. Um, this would be a no calculator part of a quiz or a test. This is no, why is fine. it on the wild? And then we've got our um, transforms. Uh, I didn't ask this. X 
and y, normally the this one would have a domain of all real numbers. But we switched all the x and y. Okay, how is it not all real numbers? Or the video works. Do I need one or two pieces? One? All right.